हेलो आई एम ए आई एंकर सना वेलकमिंग यू ऑल इन आज तक ए आई स्पेशल शो ए आई टू जी लेट्स हैव अ लुक ऑन बिग ए आई एंड टेक अपडेट्स अराउंड द वर्ल्ड टूडे लीडिंग कोरियन ऑटोमोबाइल मैन्युफैक्चर हुडाई एंड किया हैव जॉइंटली इंट्रोड्यूस्ड द सप्लायर सी ओ टू एमिशन मॉनिटरिंग सिस्टम एस सी एम एस टू मॉनिटर कार्बन एमिशन इन दर सप्लाई चेन The system uses AI and blockchain to ensure transparency and data integrity, calculating emissions at each manufacturing stage. It frees suppliers from the task, encouraging eco-friendly practices and reducing emissions. Hyundai and Kia also joined the carbon disclosure projects program to promote carbon neutrality training. By utilizing AI and blockchain, automakers are setting a standard for sustainability in their supply chains, combating climate change and supporting a greener future. Netflix is seeking a product manager of AI, offering up to $900,000 annually for their Los Gatos, California office with an option for remote work on the West Coast. The position aims to bolster its machine learning program. However, Hollywood unions are concerned about AI's growing influence on entertainment and its impact on employment and creative freedom. Netflix plans to increase AI operations and lists hyping AI careers. Amid this, Netflix is cracking down on password sharing, which may affect their shares as third quarter revenue projections fall short of expectations. A global survey by the CFA Institute shows a surge in interest in central bank digital currencies (CBDCs), with India and China leading the way. 42% of respondents worldwide support CBDC adoption, with the Asia Pacific region, particularly India (66%) and China (70%) showing the highest interest. India's EUP is undergoing pilot testing while China's ECNY is already implemented in various cities. CBDCs aim to improve financial inclusion and service efficiency with various financial institutions expressing favorable views on their potential benefits. The US SEC reportedly asked Coinbase to suspend trading in all cryptocurrencies except Bitcoin before filing a lawsuit against the company in June. Coinbase CEO Brian Armstrong revealed that the SEC recommended delisting over 200 crypto tokens which he believes would have had severe consequences for the crypto industry in the US. The SEC lawsuit alleges that Coinbase operated illegally by not registering as an exchange and trading unregistered securities. The SEC actions are part of its aggressive approach to regulating the crypto industry, causing objections from cryptocurrency companies over unclear rules and overreach. Cognizant has launched Cognizant Neuro AI, an enterprise-wide platform aimed at enabling businesses to harness the power of generative AI technology. The platform offers flexibility, security, and scalability to accelerate AI adoption and customize AI models for better business outcomes. It is built on Cognizant's proven expertise in deploying generative AI across various industries. Cognizant Neuro AI emphasizes responsible AI, inclusivity, accountability, and community benefit. The platform includes generative AI models and agents, development tools, and control components to help enterprises make informed decisions, drive cost efficiencies, and boost revenue. That's all for now in AI to Z. Thanks for watching Arch Tech AI. We will meet next time in next show. Keep watching Arch Tech AI. Goodbye.